I gotta warn you, I'm pretty good at this game. Hey, no fair! Let me guess. He beat you again? God, that kid's a freaking machine. I don't know. We'll take it fast or take it slow. We are wrong tonight. I'm telling you, Count Chocolate kicked both their asses. Whoa, wait, Blueberry could kill the Count. He's a ghost. No way, I think the Count's totally got him. He's got those fangs, he looks pretty rough. The Count couldn't attack Blueberry because he's a ghost. So what about you, Vince? <coughs> what? Had you been listening for the past 20 minutes, who do you think would win? Blueberry or Count Chocula? Frankenberry, hands down. Because look, the Count isn't even a vampire. He eats chocolate and doesn't suck blood. What kind of pussy ass vampire is that? So, what about Blueberry? True. He is a ghost and he can't be hit. See? Wait, I'm not finished. He can't hit, nor can he hit. He can't even hit Frankenberry, let alone win a fight. What about another one? What about Spider-Man versus Batman? Good one. Battle of the superheroes. That's wait, wait, wait. Batman's not a superhero. You can't be a superhero unless you have superpowers. And yes, I can. No, all he has is a lot of money to buy stupid-ass gadgets. Of course he's a superhero. No, any jackass can operate those things. He goes out and saves people and whatnot and stops villains. And so do firefighters and police officers, but you don't see them in comics or making dumbass movies, except for Backdraft. He's smart and agile. He makes his money for all those gadgets, so he must have some type of power in order to do that. Nope. If gadgets make the hero, that would make James Bond a superhero in your terms. Bond isn't a superhero. Then Batman isn't either. Being super means you're unique. Any redneck can throw a batarang. See, Aquaman is a superhero because he can talk to fish. I think Dr. Fish doesn't make me a superhero. Yeah, but they can understand him. Not because he's tripping on acid and just decides to stick his head in water and go, Hey, fishies. So, are you saying the Punisher isn't a superhero? Hell no. Having guns doesn't make you a superhero. Then what does it make you? A hero. How'd that thing get in here? I don't know, but it was a really nice shot. I can't believe I hit him. What? You knew you could have hit me? Yeah, but I didn't. That's the most important part. Maybe we should check the basement again. We could have missed something. Well... It's exactly as we left it, only the zombie's gone. Gone? The basement door is open. It's gone. Now let's head upstairs. Vince? What's up there? Some toys, small crap like that. The other day, this door was sealed shut. And now after a zombie breaches security, it's open? There's something up there. What's going on? We're going up to the attic. 
We can't. Termites, remember? Well, things change. Well, why are we going up there? The attic door is open right after a zombie gets in the house. It got in from here, and we need to seal it off. Alright, we're gonna go up. What will I do? You'll stay down here to make sure that we don't get locked out. Alright.